Hello and welcome to the 2020 election prediction between Donald Trump and Joe Biden. Today is September 2nd, 2020. We are two months away from election day and the RNC and DNC has occurred. We're now in post RNC DNC, which has caused some effects on the election. So I'm going to make my prediction as of today. But before we get started, please go and subscribe. We're 248 subscribers. Let's hit 275 by the end of the month, and let's get started. So Donald Trump will win in the states of Utah, Idaho, Montana, Wyoming, the Dakotas, Nebraska, Kansas, Oklahoma, Louisiana, Arkansas, Missouri, Louisiana, Alabama, Tennessee, Kentucky, Indiana, West Virginia, and South Carolina, as well as Alaska in the safe margin, a victory of 15% of the vote or more. For Joe Biden, California, Washington, Illinois, District of Columbia, uh, Maryland, Delaware, Rhode Island, Massachusetts, Vermont, New York, Hawaii, and Maine's first in the safe column. Donald Trump has 125 electoral votes compared to Joe Biden's 155. Moving into the likely states for Donald Trump, the state of Texas bringing Trump to 163. It's going to be narrower than it was in 2016. I'm going to say about 6-7 points, but I don't think it will fall below 5 points. For Joe Biden, the states of Oregon, New Mexico, Colorado, New Jersey, Connecticut, New, J New Hampshire, Maine at large, Virginia, all these will go to Joe Biden over 5%, but less than 15% as of now. For Donald Trump in the lean column, Georgia, Ohio, Iowa, Maine second, all going to Donald Trump. So far, no states have flipped. The rest are now going to be in the lean or tilt column. I have to do the Democratic states for lean still. For Joe Biden in the lean states, Michigan, Minnesota, Air, not Arizona, I was going for Nevada, all will go to Joe Biden as of now in the lean column, Michigan flipping from Donald Trump, going to Joe Biden, the most narrow state in 2016, going to Donald Trump by around 10,000 votes. For tilt states going to Donald Trump, North Carolina, I see Florida in the tilt column. Even though polling has showed Joe Biden leading there, usually the incumbent does win in the state of Florida. As well as Trump's approval rating there have been pretty good. Republicans did, their, did good there in the midterm elections and did good in the primary Going to Joe Biden, Arizona, Wisconsin, and Pennsylvania. Every state that's currently in tilt I see is a less than 1% margin as of now, bringing Joe Biden to 289 electoral votes, more than the 270 to win. For Nebraska's second, that will go to Donald Trump. I forgot to add that in. So as of now, I see a 249 to 289, giving Joe Biden the slight edge at the moment. There's still the debates, one coming up this month, and I think two in October, which will also have large effects on the Electoral College. I'm going to try to do a prediction every week on the Electoral College until Election Day. There will be a lot of changes, and the race seems to be narrowing. Thank you for watching. Please go subscribe, like the video, as well as hit the notification bell.